example 11 300 mm diameter pipe of friction factor 0 0.02 carries fluid at 2.4 meters per second between two tanks the entrance and exit to and from the pipe are square edge and flush with the wall of the tank find the ratio of the minor losses divided by the pipe friction loss if the length of the pipe is 1.2 meters 24 meters 480 meters so take note that friction loss is fl over d times velocity head while minor loss consists of loss coefficient times velocity head so the loss coefficient at entrance when it is square square edge is 0.5 and for submerged exit it is one so for k k exit k entrance plus k exit is at entrance 0.5 for square edge or flash entrance then exit submerged as long as it is below the liquid surface is one so 1.5 of the so the head loss due to minor connections is 1.5 of the velocity head so don't mind because the velocity head will cancel out for friction it is fl over d so 0 0.02 times length for part 1 1.2 over 0.3 so 0 0.08 so the ratio of minor to friction is 1.5 over 0 0.08 let's make 0 0.08 one so m over f m as to f is 18.75 as to 1 so meaning to say for every 1 meter loss in friction there corresponds 18.75 meters friction, um, minor loss so the minor loss is greater than the major head loss friction loss when the pipe is short such as this but when the pipe is long then the minor loss will will be less than that of the major or frictional loss so 11.2 k is still 1.5 friction would be 0 0.02 times 24 over 0.3 so that would be 1.6 so ratio of minor to friction is 1.5 as to 1.6 so 1.5 divided by 1.6 is 0.9375 as to 1 so this time they are almost the same but uh, the major loss is now greater or frictional loss is now greater so for k for third for 80 meters friction would be 0 0.02 times 480 over 0.3 so 32 so ratio of minor to frictional loss would be 1.5 as to 32 or 1.5 over 32 is 0 0.04688 as to 1 so this time you can see the minor loss is now uh, very little compared to the major or frictional loss